a dark-skinned Madonna, Royal Monastery of Santa Maria de Guadalupe. Guadalupe is a small town in central Spain. Around the end of the 13th century, a shepherd found a legendary wooden statue of the Virgin Mary here. At that time, this monastery was built by the king to enshrine the statue in a splendid Spanish Gothic style. This monastery became a religious site, attracting pilgrims to worship the Madonna. It was even referred to as the Spanish Vatican. The statue is placed at the top of the altarpiece today. This statue of the Virgin Mary is worshipped as a sacred guardian of Spain and has a distinctly dark complexion. It is believed that this statue was carved by Saint Luke the Evangelist. It is made from cedar wood and coated with black tar. Desde el punto de vista de iconografía religiosa, en el románico español, los escultores que esculpían la figura de la Santísima Virgen eh, se fijaban capitalmente en la mujer sencilla y humilde del de campesinado mediterráneo, eh, tostada por el sol y curtida eh, en las tareas y en las labores propias de eh, la cultura rural. Por lo tanto, era siempre eso, pues, mujeres mm, del pueblo, sacada de entre el pueblo, The worship of the dark-skinned Madonna then spread out from Spain to other parts of the world. Beneath the Virgin Mary is the New Continent and the Atlantic Ocean. During the Age of Discovery, Spaniards spread Roman Catholicism in Latin America. Columbus, who discovered the New Continent, also worshipped the Virgin Mary. He named one of the Caribbean islands Guadalupe in dedication to the Madonna. Columbus brought some Indians from Latin America back to Spain. He made them convert to Christianity and baptized them here. This monastery played an important part in spreading Christianity throughout the New World. This led to the widespread worship of the dark-complexioned Madonna.